Welcome to Unfold Data Science friends. My name is Aman and I am a data scientist. First of all, a big thank you to you for giving lot of love to the interview series on Unfold Data Science. Some of you guys who could not watch the interview series, you can watch some of the nice interviews here. I am pasting the link. Okay. Another thing is more and more we do something more and more we know how to do that better. So more and more I am interviewing you guys more and more I am knowing what are the different areas I can help you. Okay. So lately I have seen some people are little nervous in the interview. In this video, I am going to tell you about three tips, three tricks, very simple things using which you can avoid nervousness in the interview. I'll just take one to two minutes and tell you how to implement these tips. Okay. Let's start guys. First of all, what are we doing when we go for an interview? If you see it right, it is nothing but selling yourself. Okay. When it comes to selling, the basic thing we need is preparation. Correct. You would have seen people selling you some encyclopedia, you know, door to door. Some people sell, some people sell you some pen, few things on the street vendors, sometimes while traveling in the train, in buses, everybody is trying to sell you something then that selling attitude has to be there. So in interview, what we are trying to do is we are trying to sell ourselves. And when we go on to sell ourselves, we cannot be unprepared. Okay. So this is the tip number one, guys, don't be unprepared for very obvious questions. Okay. I'm saying very obvious questions. What are the obvious questions guys? Introduction. Everybody will ask you, right? How to introduce yourself? about your project everybody will ask you um, how to explain the project about your why are you uh, looking for a change or why are you looking for a new job these are some of the common things which you know in many interviews you can expect so why are we not very prepared on these fronts on these questions we should have a very good answer to these questions prepared answer to these questions what will happen is if you give two three answers based on what you have prepared or what you have done practice on, then your confidence will go up. Okay. From here comes the second point. Okay. The second point is don't judge yourself too much in the interview. Imagine one guy comes to you and he tries to sell you a pen. Okay. And the guy, you know, if you are not responding good, the guy start becoming nervous or the guy start becoming aggressive or the guy start becoming you know, little different behavior than normal behavior. Will you like that being a, you know, being a person who is going to buy the product? So what I'm telling you is more and more you judge yourself. For example, am I doing it good? Oh my God, I did mistake in last question. Also, this question also, I should not do the mistake. Uh, I did not know how to share the screen. This guy might be feeling bad or this guy might be judging me on this. I did not know how to uh, you know, write FLS loop in Python. So this guy might be judging me. Oh my God, I have already done wrong in the interview. I'm doing bad in the interview. All these analysis you can do after the interview. Okay. You can identify which areas needed improvement. You can, you know, improve on that during the interview. Do not judge yourself. Rather focus on what is coming and how you have to respond to it. That's all simple. Third point guys, always remember, this is one point I keep telling every now and then nobody knows everything. Okay. So it's not like somebody who is sitting on the other side of the table is a very, you know, very scholar guy. He knows all the things on the earth, everything he knows, you know, he, everything you tell, he will try to, he's, he's a better, he's having more knowledge of that thing than you quite possible that. I'm explaining some topic. For example, I explain CNN. It is quite possible that the person on the other side may not have any idea on CNN. It is possible guys. Okay. So don't think that person on the other side is a genius and you are, you know, you are not that good in front of him. It's not like that. You have done something else that that person has done something else. You are there to explain what you have done. Okay. So your focus should be on how you can explain what you have done nicely, how much of grip you have on what you have done. And then the interview will go smooth. 
another bonus tip guys even if you are getting rejected it is not end of the world right there is no dearth of organizations companies nothing nothing to be nervous about okay so keep these three things in mind what are these three things don't be unprepared for obvious questions second don't judge yourself too much during the interview and third don't think that other person knows too much and you don't know anything in front of him or her next bonus thing i told any interview is not end of the world or is not going to you know play a very major role if you see the long career that you are going to have okay one more thing i want to put here which i follow not in interviews and not in not only in interviews but in real life as well there are two aspects guys one is preparation anything in life right one is preparation another is result on what we have the control do we have the control on result most of the times in life no we have the control only on the preparation part same applies to the interviews just take care of your preparation part don't bother about the result part okay that is what i follow take care of the preparation part don't bother on the result part and things will start becoming smooth for you okay and if we are talking of selling if you are talking of preparation then i want to recommend two movies here guys first is the wolf of wall street i am sure many of you would have seen this 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 these movies i am recommending is about how do you sell something or you know how how do people prepare for selling something right so the first point i am talking preparation for the interview preparation for the obvious questions so you should you should keep ball in your coat you should be driving the interview okay so one movie is wolf of wall street and another hindi movie is rocket singh so maybe you can watch this movie with some subtitle if you are not able to understand hindi this is a very good movie and wolf of wall street if you have not watched a must watch movie okay so this is the summary of this video guys just remember those three four points what we discussed write me in comment what do you feel about these points give me a thumbs up if you like this video and kindly subscribe the channel and press the bell icon if you want the notification from unfold data science i'll see you all in the next video till then wherever you are stay safe and take care